you can almost feel the atmosphere building to a crescendo. Real electricity here in the air at the Etihad. It's Manchester City against Arsenal. Stay tuned, it's live on EA TV. Hello everyone, well here's something we say every day of the week, don't we? It's a beautiful day for football in Manchester at the Etihad Stadium. I'm Derek Ray in the commentary position and I'm joined for expert analysis by my partner Stuart Robson. And we've got Premier League action coming right up. It is Manchester City and they take Erling Haaland. Splendid defending. And so they start at 11 for Manchester City. Ederson is the goalkeeper. Phil Foden plays alongside Rodri in the centre of midfield. And leading the line today is Erling Haaland. A gift for any goalkeeper. Here are the starters for Arsenal. Bukayo Saka plays with Leandro Trossard out wide. And they line up with just the one striker looking to do a bit of damage. he did well to win it back Trossard this looks promising Havertz well that's really sound goalkeeping not letting the opposition have any scraps and City being afforded too much room could play it in Incredible clearance. I must say, I didn't see that coming. Perfect challenge. Gundogan. That's excellent defending following the cross. So a deflection, and they can get ready for the corner kick routine. Can someone get on the end of this? It's still alive, and holding on to it at the second time of asking. They've given it away. So deflection, and it will be a throw in. Gabriel. And here's Saliba. Declan Rice. An encouraging Arsenal move. And Kai Havertz. Superbly read and executed. Erling Haaland. Can he put them in front? Yes is the emphatic answer. And you have to say it was on the cards. Well, just look at this again. He's so hard to knock off the ball once he gets going. Of course the defending could be better, but that's a great individual goal. Started by Arsenal. A wake up call for the Arsenal players, perhaps. Can they construct a response? Saka and Arsenal now find themselves in potentially a dangerous position. Has eyes for goal. Well, on a good day, that might have gone in for the equaliser. Yeah, I agree. That was half a chance, I would say. But they still trail here. Plenty of support here. And now they sense victory. Well, just look at this again. He moves the ball quickly, he gets beyond his marker and he keeps his composure. It's an excellent finish. Well, Pep looks very pleased, doesn't he? His side have been absolutely excellent today. So underway once more, 2-0 the lead here. Throw in here for Arsenal. Thomas Partey. 
Arsenal pushing forward with options available. Has eyes for goal. He quartered the attack illegally. Now perhaps a card is forthcoming. Well, the card is out, and it's yellow. Yeah, it's clumsy, and it's late. Definitely a yellow card. And a respectably hit free kick, almost shaving the post. Yeah, he might strike it nicely, but it's a waste if you miss the target. You've got to make the goalkeeper work. And nothing comes of that attack. Inching towards the interval, and it's going with home advantage. Stewart, as always, very keen to get your take. Well, they're dominating this first Oh, time. Stewart, they might be onto something. And effectively parried away by the keeper. And players waiting in the centre. Real chance. And still danger here. Oh, good play, this. Did well to clear it away. And that is going to be all for the first 45 then here at the Etihad Stadium. Well, we know what Erling Haaland is capable of, but it's still difficult trying to contain him as the opposition have found out here. Well, he's looked unstoppable today. Quick, clever, skillful, and he's taken his goals really well. He's been wonderful to watch. Second half underway here, and Arsenal quite simply need to lift themselves. City pushing forward with options available. And dealt with that ball comfortably. Rodri. Well, it looked highly promising, but they got nothing out of it. Breaking at pace. He's taken on his opponent here. Has a go. Still a chance. Erling Haaland, perfect challenge, plenty of support here. And teammates to play it to. Good looking pass, intercepting it intelligently. Arsenal move it forward with purpose and control. Well, it came to nothing in the end. A deft clearance. Excellent use of advantage. The tackle completely missed time, and you would expect a booking under the circumstances. And that is going to mean a caution. The referee is absolutely right. He knew what he was doing there. Foden crossing into the middle thumps clear just the challenge that was required Declan Rice now the counter attack looks on just to let you know the club shop is open after today's William game. Saliba like to get your tickets for the next game of club well, the attack Rice. looks promising And he takes it on. A gift for any goalkeeper. Foden. Well read to win possession back. And City have possession once more. Foden. Excellent vision. Oh, it almost did the trick for them. Great defending. And into the last 15 minutes of action. It's looking promising. Jesus, in it goes to alter the arithmetic and give them hope that they can turn this round. 
Well, here we can see it again. Look at the way he glides past the defender to create space for himself. And the finish from Jesus is absolutely perfect. There's no stopping that. That's a really good goal. Well, they've gone to sleep here, and he can't believe it. This will be an interesting game now. On they go again, and that goal for Arsenal means they can now entertain thoughts of perhaps drawing level. Ten minutes to go. Veering in field here. Is it going to be? Oh, really commanding goalkeeping. Foden. Well, nicely cut out. Now what can they do with the ball? Well, was that Arsenal's last chance? Time is running out here in what has been a very frustrating game for them. Mind you, that was a really good save, wasn't it? Yes, end-to-end -end stuff, but now they're forced to track back. Giving it a try, and they're still in with a shot, thanks to the keeper just then. Well, that's a really important save, but can they get back into this match? I'm not sure they can. And so the referee blows the whistle. It is the end of the contest, and the three points go to Manchester City. Well, Derek, it was very competitive. Chances at both ends, but I feel they were the better team, and they deserve their victory.